Wow. Sorry, my hair's still wet. Going to Asda before we get bus to the beach. No. <laughs> no, going to Asda. Gonna get some money out for the bus. And then, yeah, get some snacks, get some drinks because it's almost an hour to get the bus there. And then, yeah. Hello, everyone. Welcome back. I know it's been a very long time since I last posted on my channel, but I'm hoping as I'm now at uni and I have a bit more time to myself, I can start filming a lot more for you guys um, as you can see from the previous clip we are at the beach we come to Whitstable and just gonna vlog the whole thing just show you guys the experience that we're having <laughs> Some of you watchers read my blog, you know that I'm at Canterbury Christchurch University and it's about just over an hour on the bus to Whitstable, which is where we are now. Um, so we've literally just got off of the bus. We've had a little sit down, a little walk around and we are now walking to the harbour can take some nice photos for my blog and everything we'll keep you updated we've actually come here when it's quite late so quite a few of the shops are closing so we're now just kind of walking around looking for a fish and chip shop to go to there's one I remember down the road that's quite nice from when I was younger oh look at that sweet shop Should we go in there? yeah let's have a look in this sweet shop okay. so we're sitting in the fish and chip shop okay. And I'm that sort of person who will get extremely hungry and then I'll get to that point where I'm then eating and I will get very, very full. So I've got cotton chips and curry sauce because I cannot eat fish and chips without curry sauce. And they've got some pickles. Pickle wreck. So I've got pickles. Uh, we went to the sweet shop and we got some um, strawberry toffee bonbons and some blue raspberry bonbons. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> I really don't like pickles. Thank you. I really wanted that. But we're now just trying to eat as much as we can before we start walking back to the bus stop to then get the bus home because Liv's got an event tonight. Mm -hmm. So we're going to go to that and probably just watch some films. So yeah. So we were sat at a bench literally a couple of metres away from the bus stop back home. And the bus come, we literally picked up our bags and it closed the doors and then Liv went up to the, like, the bus door and the bus driver just didn't stop, he just carried on going. So we've now got to wait another 20, 25 minutes to actually then get the bus home. And we're sat out outside a cute little school. And then the other side, there's some really nice houses and stuff. But a little bit down the road, there is a super, super old Weatherspoons. And it looks like it's in an old like picture house or something. But that looks really nice, so if I come here again, I might go in there because I quite like the spoons. But yeah, we're now going to wait 20 minutes for the bus. Okay, so Asda is literally next door to my flat and whenever we come in here, we always go down the Halloween aisle. And we was down here at 4.30 in the morning a couple of days ago. And we were just looking at decorations and everything, the size of outfits. 
we brought devil horns, um, we brought like a unicorn horn thing for something that I'll do a video about in a couple of weeks time once we've got everything planned out a bit more. But, <laughs> but the Halloween Isle is my favourite place. <laughs>